Hi, Gamer Centric here, uh, Commander Ashenfox. Welcome to this short tutorial on creating macros. Specifically, specifically for pips, but obviously it can be used for anything. Uh, pips in Elite Dangerous. Um, so, first thing you need to make sure is that uh, in the game you don't have the hat that you want to use assigned to the controls that you want to use. So as you can see here I've got my power to engines, weapons, systems and reset uh, on the cursor keys. These are the standard bindings as well but uh, I find them useful for this purpose and I have the hat on my right hand stick. I use a, a hot ass a a stick on the right and a throttle on the left. So I have the standard uh, assignments also on my stick so that I can change them manually if I need to. But the important thing being I don't have the hat that I use on the throttle mapped for the macros mapped to any actual control in the game. So if we go back to Joystick Gremlin now. We're on my crate profile. Uh, it's activated at the moment as you can see. Um, yeah, when you first start uh, Joystick Gremlin and you create a profile, you do not need to create a mapping. Most tutorials start with creating a mapping because they include joystick curves. You don't need to create a mapping. This is what creates a virtual joystick and sometimes causes problems for some people. So don't map uh, any joystick things that you don't need to map. For curves, personally, I have an X56, so I use the X56 application. So I don't need to do that here. If you do want to do curves with Joystick Gremlin, you can, but you will need to use the mapping and the virtual joystick, and that has other complications that we're not going to cover in this video. So, just very quickly, um, when you select the the right device, in this case it's going to be my Thrustmaster throttle on my left, and you press the control that you want to use, it takes you down to that control automatically. There we are, it's the hat. As you can see, I've already assigned some, some macros here. Um, now the trick here is simply to uh, create a macro uh, by doing on this menu macro and then add. And that creates this window here. And then literally all you do is you record your macro with the keystrokes that you see here. You press record, you press some keystrokes, then you stop recording. And the most important part of all is the virtual button. If this is an actual hat then you'll have this menu, virtual button, and you'll have to choose the actual hat direction that you want this control to, this macro to be activated by. As you can see in this one I've got my four macros for my four directions. Um, so uh, rather than mess up the ones I have already, uh, what I'll do is I'll, I'll use another hat uh, on this throttle which is the bottom hat but it's not really a hat as you can see as I'm pressing the hat directions it's changing single buttons so this is not a hat in the same way that this is a hat it looks like a hat on the thing and it acts like a hat but really it's four independent direction buttons so uh, four independent joystick buttons so I have to assign, assign those manually so a quick demonstration if I want to assign a macro to this which is the button 13 is the down direction on my bottom hat on the throttle I simply go macro add um, I don't have to set which control this is the up down left or right because the up down left or right are separate buttons on this particular hat but if it was a true hat like this one then I would have to select the correct direction button on the tab here as shown before so I just press record and let's say I want this one to be uh, three pips to weapons and three pips to engines so always start with a reset command which is the down arrow and then uh, it's going to be two pips to the right one two and that's going to leave us one so two pips up yeah that should do it down two right two up that should give us zero three three pips I stop recording that's it once again if I had to assign a direction now's the time do it there and that's it, just save the profile, I'm not going to, but save the profile, activate it, and that's it, ready to rock and roll. Hope it helps.
Ashen Fox out.